very warm welcome into this uh, first live stream uh, from Aquatech China and in my case from Dusseldorf in Germany. Um, we are uh, Sunresin, uh, one of the major uh, uh, enterprise in the uh, uh, ion exchange adsorber and all uh, that has to do with separation technologies. This um, company is a family business, which is a very central to uh, success in industry all around the world. Uh, founded by uh, a couple uh, about 20 years ago, and which has been uh, developing very strongly and striving since then on a regular pace. Uh, the Sun Resin, as it stands, has, uh, uh, you can see on the picture here, it's headquartered in Xi'an. We are based in Xi'an, uh, Shanxi province in uh, China, and I will show you a, a bit more where that is in a second. And uh, then uh, if my colleagues could move to the next slides, I would be very grateful. So, um, as you can see, uh, the location map in uh, China um, allows you to have a better idea where uh, our uh, plants are located. Um, the Shanxi province looks a little bit like uh, the United Kingdom once it has lost uh, Scotland. And uh, we have in uh, uh, three dots there corresponding to our three main locations all within 150 kilometers from one another. The headquarters are located, as mentioned earlier, in Xi'an. Xi'an is the uh, uh, province uh, 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 capital of the Shanxi province, and that's also um, the site of the first uh, Chinese uh, unified empire. And that's where you will find, when I'm sure you'll have the opportunity to come and visit our factories, you will uh, have a chance to visit the a tomb of the first Chinese emperor with the famous uh, uh, terracotta warriors guarding the first emperor in his tomb. And just outside of uh, Xi'an, we have Gaoling and Pucheng, which are uh, our two main industrial sites uh, located both uh, outside of, uh, uh, of the city, respectively 40 kilometers and 150 kilometers. So if my colleagues in China could switch the page now to the next one, then um, we would we would then continue. Thank you very much. So we have now R and D, uh, and uh, you know being successful as we have been over the past twenty years does not come if you try to just do uh, commodity products and focused on the lowest possible value and the simplest products. You cannot establish value for your customers if you are, if you corner yourself literally into this uh, low value, low quality type of market. And it was a, a very uh, bright and intelligent decision from uh, our chairwoman and uh, husband uh, at the time to decide to go for the high price, to decide to go for the high quality materials and uh, this they did by investing heavily and regularly in research and development. And uh, we have been continuously investing uh, between 5 and 10% of our sales into research and development every year. I've received for that uh, a trove of uh, patents, obviously, for our own intellectual property, but also many prizes from the Chinese Academy of Science uh, which, uh, among others, two uh, national prizes from uh, uh, the president of our organization uh, for the development of uh, lithium purification, which is today a critical material to power the uh, electro uh, vehicles all around the world. Yeah. So this uh, R&D effort is led by a group of about 80 to 90 people who uh, are all engineers and uh, doctors and PhDs in uh, chemistry and are uh, managing to move ahead uh, our uh, technical knowledge uh, in all the fronts. We are an interesting company also for you as uh, our customers or 
uh, would-be uh, or to-be customers, uh, among others, because we cover the base that all of them do cover. But none of them does cover as much technological base as we do. And that's a very interesting situation, I can tell you. So um, if you are looking for a, a manufacturer of, um, of uh, uniform particle size material, we mentioned already, uh, they are us, yeah, and the three majors from the Western world, yeah, from the OECD, we could say, yeah. Uh, for chelating resins, you will find us and uh, uh, also uh, the uh, three majors. And uh, for adsorbers resins, uh, yes, uh, you would find us uh, and only two of the majors uh, since uh, the German competitor is not really uh, represented in that area of uh, absorbing technologies. They don't have the technologies for that. Okay, so you can see our product portfolio is the widest which is on the market um, and covers the largest application areas from the most traditional like uh, energy production and demineralization of the water to the most advanced, my colleague mentioned earlier, uh, purification in the process production of a vaccine uh, around the world, yeah? Yes, monojet technologies, this is quite important. In many industrial applications uh, and in many chromatographic systems, it is well known that having a chromatographic media whose bead size are very narrow uh, allows you to have a better uh, a level of uh, a theoretical plates, as you say in uh, chromatographic uh, vocabulary. And that means a better separation ability for components. And uh, this technology is extremely complex to develop. Um, and we uh, have uh, built our first uh, uh, monojet factory now in 2019, and we have been producing another a lot of experience. The interesting part is we produce both gel type uh, resins as well as macro reticulated or macroporous, depending on the vocabulary you will use to character characterize these. Um, uh, we produce both polymers, gel or macroporous, uh, uh, in the uniform particle size uh, technology and can offer correspondingly products not just for water treatment, as some of our competitors are doing. Uh, uh, look, for instance, uh, uh, in Asia and uh, Japan, you will not get uniform particle size polymer in macroporous shape from these guys. And uh, uh, we can produce them also in macroporous shape, which is very important in order to be able to support customers, for instance, in the food transformation industry, but also in mining for hydrometallurgy. So this we do also very well. And this is a big advantage. Um, obviously, there is no sustainable uh, development of relationship with customers if you don't provide good quality and reliable quality. And we have a very uh, advanced and elaborate uh, technology platform to ensure that we do quality control, but the best quality control is the quality control you just do in order to confirm that the results that came out of production are excellent. And uh, we have implemented a lot of automation in our production units in order to make sure that the results delivered uh, during in each production lot are uh, highly reproducible, uh, allowing us to be very confident that every time we do quality control, we find good results in our uh, products. They are uh, within, uh, within one sigma deviation uh, at the maximum, yeah. So, um, we have also been, like every company in the world, uh, ch been challenged last year uh, by a very much reduced ability to communicate physically, to visit customers around the world. And uh, uh, we have implemented um, uh, a remote monitoring uh, center that allows you, uh, us to, uh, thanks to uh, most advanced technologies in terms of communication, both um, both in terms of uh, video as well as in terms of electronic medias uh, to uh, monitor activity uh, at customer plans to support customer when they want to start their uh, new unit which they have built together with us or when they want to troubleshoot uh, some uh, issues they may have into their uh, production unit. And we do that uh, together with them. We have a dedicated uh, communication center with, uh, you know, 
white screens and so on. It looks like a little bit, uh, uh, you know, uh, a, m a movie ab about the space uh, adventure and uh, Houston. In our case, it's uh, Xi'an. Uh, we need your help and we are there to help. Yes. So maybe, uh, yes, the next page. I mentioned this point as being an, ex an essential element in having good quality. Uh, all our productions are based on standard operation procedures, which are uh, uh, repeated uh, every time by the production team. Uh, and these uh, uh, operation procedures are then monitored by automatic control systems and uh, by online monitoring uh, from the team. And uh, our manufacturing units are uh, very uh, modern. And that's uh, one of the key elements we could mention about ourselves is that we have made a sustained, regular and very important capital investment in developing our production capacity over the last years, um, which when you look around the market globally is not something you find so easily. Uh, as a matter of fact, or the large major competitors around the world have not invested anything um, much more to the point, they have closed factory all over the place, yeah, and leading to a crunch on supply globally, um, which is not just because of the pandemic. It is a crunch of supply which has been dating for the past three or four years at the very least. And uh, um, in 2018, we built two new manufacturing sites in Gaoling and in Pucheng. And uh, these two platforms allow us uh, both two things, to have now a lot of capacity available to serve your requirements. And our typical delivery times is 30 days. I'm not talking in months. Yeah, I'm talking in days, 30 days, not 30 months like you may wait at our uh, beloved competitors uh, from Dupont or Lanxess. And uh, after 30 days, typically your material is ready, X works to be shipped. Um, and uh, these two major platforms allow us to have capacity now, but allow us to have space for expansion in the coming 10 years uh, uh, that uh, can be uh, manifold the capacity we have uh, uh, established up to now. Yeah? So you can rest assured, if you place your business with us, we will have the means to support you in the future and for the long term. So. Um, and this is not the result of uh, an accident. This is because we are a family enterprise. We are stock listed, which means um, our ability to develop the business is supported by a huge number of in private investors and investment funds who are giving us the means to do such investments as you have been seeing. As you may imagine, a capital investment in such types of factories amounts to tens of millions of dollars for each of the factory. And these kind of investments are also a sign for you, our customers, that we are a safe partner. And our uh, economic figures are published regularly uh, since we are stock listed. And you can verify them um, on the stock exchange in Shenzhen. We are listed under number 300487. And if you look in Yahoo Finance, for instance, you type 300487 dot s z and you will have access to sun resin new materials uh, financial details so why choose us very simply excellent and reproducible uh, resin performance stable resin supply also in the future do not wait 30 months buy now from us uh, and uh, go beyond your fear of leaving the majors who have misused you over the years competitive pricing obviously we have other cost structures than companies who entertain uh, uh, private jets huh? and uh, we can uh, offer you value for the product you are buying from us so that you can generate value for yourself. Short delivery times, I mentioned that uh, already a few times and our long-term commitment to develop further this business uh, is something you can trust. You can be sure we will not sell this business in six months. And this is a family business for the next generation. And, and so uh, we will be there to support you for the long term. As I mentioned too, we have uh, a timely uh, technical service which is available all the time. 
So we will uh, now go into a bit more details about our involvement in water treatment, and we have specific presentation about that uh, by uh, uh, our colleague Henry. And uh, afterwards, we will switch to uh, 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 technical uh, topics around uh, uh, chelating resins. And I would like to mention too also uh, one of the areas where our fingerprint is substantially different to that of uh, our major uh, OECD competitors is the fact that we can uh, deliver you uh, ready to use equipment if you wish so. Huh? We are very happy to sell you ion exchange resin adsorber separation systems on their own. But if you need an equipment just for one piece of your production line, we will be happy uh, to do this if obviously it's complex enough, it requires uh, some process development. This is the kind of things we can do very well together with our customers and we'll be happy to do that all around the world. And uh, you can see all, all these pieces I mentioned up to now are building together. We can ship an equipment to you, help you to start it up, monitor the way it runs together with you when you wish so. And when you uh, have any form of difficulty, we can patch ourselves in. And uh, once you have allowed us uh, to do so and help you find the solution, even uh, from a distance, which is a very efficient way uh, to uh, make sure you can make the most of the equipment we are providing you with, if you wish to have equipment. And this is our reason, our remote uh, solution and operation and monitoring center uh, in Xi'an. You can see here a picture on the day of inauguration. So it's, it looks on the left-hand side as just one picture, but it's basically, you can align there are, I think, uh, 12 uh, different monitors of large size, which allow us to have 12 different situations to be monitored at the same time if that uh, needs to be. Or, uh, yes, having a camera on one plant and at the same time looking at the parameters which are coming from the uh, process control system and so on. So it's uh, very uh, well done and it uh, allows us to move uh, into many areas. So from a, a application fingerprint, which industries are we targeting? Uh, we have mentioned obviously uh, healthcare at the beginning uh, with uh, uh, you know the pandemic fight against the virus with uh, vaccine manufacturing but obviously separation technologies are used in all the areas of healthcare uh, from a carrier used for medicine themselves for apis which are swallowed by customers uh, to uh, purification steps into uh, manufacturing we are present in all these areas Obviously, in food processing, our adsorbers are instrumental in allowing you to have, for instance, uh, uh, colorful food uh, based on pigments that have been recovered from uh, plants. So fully natural pigments recovered by fully natural means uh, and uh, of different colors. These are things that we have been doing with our customers around the world. Um, after that, uh, we are a world leading specialist in metal extraction and chemical processing. In metal extraction, we are supporting the purification of lithium, I mentioned that, but also nickel, cobalt and other metals like gold uh, or uranium are recovered and purified with our uh, materials. And if you can recover metal, obviously you can prevent contamination of water, uh, groundwater by uh, providing to customers uh, polishing systems that allow them to remove traces of metals before their effluents are being released into the environment. And we can do that very well too. If you are into water treatment, I just want to mention drinking water. We are obviously very strong in that area. We help customers make fantastic little cartridges that are used in water pitchers that you put on the table and which filtrate the water. Uh, we also uh, support um, major municipal uh, plants to remove nitrate or to remove boron from uh, water, uh, which are important applications all over the world. And uh, at this point, I think I would uh, pass the word back to my colleagues uh, in, uh, in Shanghai and uh, let them continue the presentation on these more technical points.